In Washington, a shocking reversal in the criminal case of President Trump's longtime friend and ally, Roger Stone. It's led to a protest and charges of interference. Four career prosecutors withdrew from Stone's case after the Justice Department rejected their recommendation for a seven to nine year prison sentence. This morning, the president praised Attorney General William Barr for stepping in. Jeff Pegues is at the Justice Department with more on this story. Jeff, this was such a stunner when it broke yesterday. What are you hearing there? Well, DOJ officials insist that they did not talk to the White House about this sentencing, but they did make it clear that they were unhappy with the prosecutors in this case. But hours before they made this decision to seek a more lenient sentence, the president was tweeting, calling the original recommendation horrible and a miscarriage of justice. And then this morning, the president congratulated his attorney general for, quote, taking charge of the case that was totally out of control. Now, keep in mind, in November, November, a jury found Stone guilty on all seven counts against him, including witness tampering, obstruction, and lying to Congress. The case, of course, stemmed from the investigation into Russia's meddling in the 2016 election. Some Democratic members of Congress are already calling for an investigation into DOJ's actions. However, Ultimately, the sentencing comes down to the judge, Judge Amy Berman Jackson. She is the same judge who sentenced the former Trump campaign chairman, Paul Manafort. Tony, back to you. All right, Jeff. We'll have to see what that judge decides on February 20th. Thank you very much.